Hey, how's it going everyone? Uh, I wanted to do a quick walk around video of my 2008 uh, custom bike. Uh, we call it the Whiskey Bike uh, with the Jack Daniels theme. Uh, back in 2008, uh, Jack Daniels commissioned Alley Rat Customs in Las Vegas to build this bike for them. And um, basically this is what they came up with. Uh, made to resemble an empty whiskey casket or barrel. It's got all the wood grain. Flows perfectly along the edges with the banding separating the black and wood. Smooth handlebars, no controls. What we did there was uh, internal right throttle on the left side an internal left twist for the front brake that's right guys I said it we did a left twist on the front brake master cylinder reservoir underneath the tank cable driven pumps the fluid up to the front hey it works uh, when this bike was built it didn't run and a lot of people knew it didn't run the only wires that were hooked up on the bike when I bought it were the air ride it was two wires as far as the rest of the bike goes, the, the wrong pistons, wrong internals, the rear axle was shot. Basically everything front to back was wrong on the bike. And it was originally just made to be a statue, a prop, competition show bike, whatever you want to call it. I acquired the bike about two years ago and decided I was going to change that and make it a running show bike. And it's taken two years, but it's finally here. Just real quick uh, on the details, custom made front and rear fender, custom made tank, custom made oil bag, handlebars. It's a War Eagle single sided frame, uh, it's been modified a little bit, but it is a War Eagle single sided frame. Uh, also has one off War Eagle wheels on front and back. Bare asset seat that's no longer in business out of Las Vegas. It's like a uh, real fine suede. Running the jockey shifter still, just like it was in the original uh, build, but we did add an EFM auto clutch, so you don't have to pull the hydraulic clutch in to basically stop the bike or, or keep it out of gear. Uh, the auto clutch will do that for you just by uh, letting off the gas. Foot brake does the, the rear uh, performance machine, but uh, break, but this was what was really interesting trying to make the bike functional while keeping it looking original and that was keeping the handlebars clean with the uh, internal left brake there and it works really good actually Ultima 127 cubic inch with Ross racing pistons Magna charger supercharger the carbs are Makuni. Billet for you open primary. Baker 6 B transmission. It has an SAS air ride suspension, which is simplified air suspension by custom cycle controls in Las Vegas. The self contained air ride fits underneath the uh, transmission, it's all self contained. This is one of their hand controls with the built in reservoir. These switches also run the uh, air ride up and down. First video I made of this bike was the night that we've got it running for the first time, but since then we had to pull the flywheel, balance it, weld it, and do a lot of extra things just to make it more functional, rebuild the rear axle, things like that. So, uh, compression release valves manual, just like any other custom bike, really. But, I mean, it fires right up.
thing is looks pretty badass, right? Rolling down. <laughs> 